Step in the box, baseball fans. Welcome back to another episode. I've had these hanging around for a while. Got a couple boxes of Tops On Demand 3D. Just been sitting around, and I have five hanger boxes of 2021 Series 2. Figured I'd get these open. Got a card show coming up, but appreciate you stepping in the box. Welcome in. If you're new here, always do recaps. So if you don't have the time, fast forward, go through the recap. I'm going to save these to last. Again, I have not seen these. I ordered them. It's like, hey, why not? But I got a card show coming up, so I'm going to get these open before that card show. Pull out the inserts and stuff. Hope everybody's having a great Saturday. Dig the cleats in. We're in the box. Let's see if we can hit a bomb. Hopefully we can pull a short print here. Opened up some of these not too long ago. No short prints. Let's see what we can pull. Series two. Update series is going to be coming out pretty soon this fall. Who's excited for some series two? Or not series two, but update. Sorry, excuse me. Total amateur hour there. Never claim to be anything more. But if you've been watching from the beginning, appreciate it. If you're new here again, hit that subscribe and like button. And we have a rookie rainbow foil. I'm going to sleeve him right off the bat. A little bit of Nick on the corner. JT Brewerbaker. Rookie foil. Bryce Harper, that one's a cool one. Correa, Carlson, DeGrom, Ballinger's been terrible, Bregman, no short print there. Looking for that curl off here in this horizontal. What a day it is here in Northern Illinois. The weather is beautiful. Had a good Saturday here. Notre Dame took down Wisconsin. So no big rookies there. That box was kind of a dud. But you can't win them all. This box is a little beat up. Let's see what it has inside. Again, if you're in the Chicago or Wisconsin area, Milwaukee, there's a show in Oak Creek, Wisconsin. It's been pretty solid. Next Saturday, October 2nd, I believe it is. Oak Creek at the Salvation Army. It's been a good show, like 70 tables. Good variety, or 70 vendors, more tables than just 70. We got one of my favorite cards coming up of the year. I think these cards look super sick, chrome. There's a curl off. We've got a gold in that pack too. Nice. Sleeve the curl off. Hopefully he comes back next year and keeps hitting. This is the card I'm talking about. Elo Jimenez. I love these cards. And let's see who the gold is. It's a rookie pitcher. Never know with the Rays. What's that? Josh Fleming. So a couple parallels of rookies. Rainbow foil, there's a gold. Although the rainbow foil is not really a parallel, but. Tyler Stevenson, rookie. Acuna Jr. Got a car horn going off. Sorry for that. Amateur hour, I don't have a studio. Cronenworth, rookie. Cup. Still can't believe the Padres are not going to make the playoffs. What a bummer. Lou Bob is about ready to make a run. He's been a hitting machine, guys. Still have my money on the Dodgers. So that's box two. A couple of rookies. That box is a lot better. That Eloy Chrome. 
a gold of Fleming, Cronenworth, I said it again, sorry about this horn, not sure what's going on, I'm going to have to go bust some skulls, take a good old Easton reflex out of the bedroom, go crack some skulls, go full on Sammy Sosa to the dome. <laughs> Good old slamming Sammy. You know, the Cubs should open arm, bring him back. Get him in. It's so frustrating. That guy filled the seats. And as an old-time Cubs fan, Sammy Sosa was so fun to watch. I was in college when, high school and college, during those times, Joey Bart right there. Man, that was fun. KB, Mountcastle, Garcia. So no short print. Man, got two more of these. Looking for those short print guys. Got a few more things to open before the show next uh, Saturday. Get this stuff put in. I like to, one of my keys is I like to get this stuff open and get the inserts and sell the inserts of the shows. Because lots of people are looking for those. It's one of my main sellers at shows. People always think that you make the money on the shows at like huge, huge cards. 95% of my sales are less than five bucks. This horn's driving me nuts. Now I'm really starting to get aggravated. Walsh Cup card. Haven't seen, I know he got off to a decent start of the year. I don't know how he's done. There's a jazz card. This this whole video is going to have car horns in it. Nothing I can do, guys. I don't have a soundproof studio. Don't claim to be more than amateur hour. Doors are open. 70 degrees here. Can't beat it. It is annoying. Ooh, we have a... Uh, I think these are numbered out of uh, 70. We have a nice looking parallel. Come on, how about a Key Brian Hayes parallel? We're getting there. Might salvage the video. Who is it? Here it comes. Oh, it's a pitcher. And it's Trevor Bauer out of 70. I always forget what they're calling these. These seventh, I guess these are the seventh and 70th anniversary. Like silver? Man, that would be nice if we got that. In, uh... And here's a cool Willie Mays. Set that aside for my buddy. Any trout's a good trout. Sleeve the trout. This is another good seller at shows. Trouts. Those usually sell immediately. Dollar trout, dollar holler, guys. Come to a show, get a trout for a dollar. One dollar holler. What are you guys looking forward to next? Hoping to get some optic basketball next week. Another Cronenworth, nice. That's why hanger boxes are so great. Two Cronenworths and four boxes, guys. I don't remember if the Chaz was in that last one. One more hanger box, then we got the Tops 3D. Again, I'm excited for the Tops 3D because I have no idea what's in it. Don't know what they look like. Haven't even seen them. I just ordered that day. I don't know why I ordered them. I just saw them and was like, I'm going to order those. I've never opened those before. Wanted something new. And then just hadn't found a reason to open them. 
It's like these five hangers plus that might make a nice opening. And then of course, you got the car horn in the parking lot. Working us why we're trying to hit some bombs. There's a jazz, so two jazzes and two chronoworths. That's not so bad. Put those in a box, let them mature, see what happens. Maybe one of them becomes a player. And we got an Ice Ice Baby. It's a Brewer. It's a Rookie. Drew Rasmussen. Ice Ice Baby Orange. So we had another pitcher in uh, parallel. Right behind him, we've got a Rookie Rainbow Foil. Catcher. Jonah Heim. Rangers. And then we've got a 0 to 60 U Darvish Cubs. No longer Cub. Lou Bob, there's a Jazz and a Bohm. Coming down to the end of Series 2. Again, I sort the rookies out of this, sell the bulk base. And we're getting on to the tops 3D coming up. I'm excited for that. There's that. All right, here we go. Let me get a little bit of this out of the way. So I can open the 3D. I'm going to sleeve this Eli Chrome. Man, that's a good looking card. What do you guys think about those? I think those are great. Some of my favorites. Okay. Coming up, Tops On Demand 3D set. Better be in there. I think that's what it is. That's what I ordered. No going back. That's the bad thing about these boxes, man. You got to label them because you don't know what's inside. It could be any on demand product if you order this stuff often. Again, feels like just one pack, so there's no uh, container. Let's see what we got here. Oh, whoa, these are crazy. 3D. Again, this is my first time opening. This is crazy. Who do we got here? Dustin May. Man, that's sick. They're nice and thick, too. Wow. Pavin Smith, rookie. Put that here. Stanton. We got a parallel, I think, down there. I think. Loriano. Oh, Tani. I like that, Otani. I'm going to sleeve Mr. Otani. I don't even know how much I paid for these. I'll have to go back and look. Otani. Oh, we got Kenta Maeda. And an Alec Bohm. That one is really cool. Is this numbered? It is not numbered. It's like Grand Central Station around my neighborhood right now. I guess that's not numbered, but that's cool looking if you ask me. Check that out. Boom. Boom. Throw the hands. Let the big dog eat. Barrel it up. Mmm. It's a 3D. You've just received a motion card 3D. And then if you didn't notice, we had a Joey Bart. What's the Joey Bart doing here? Same thing. That's super lame. The Rhino. <laughs> I tell you what, I like the Bohm a lot better. But those are cool. I think those are great cards. All right. Last box. Let's see what we got. I don't even know if you can hit parallels in there, but those are cool. I I kind of like these. I wouldn't buy any more, but I like these. 
I like them a lot. Last pack, Mojo. So it looks like I can get two of those motion ones. And there is a bone on top. I wonder what these would look like in a PSA slab. They're nice and thick. That is cool. Got a Sunny Gray. Alex Bregman. Charlie Blackman. Boba Shet. I like the bow. Ooh, and Acuna Jr. And I wonder if these are all rookies. Posh. Boom. Would he hit it and then take off running? And the last one, Tristan McKenzie. That one's cool. Going through his throwing motion. What'd you guys think of this Tops 3D? Be pretty cool set to put together. That ended up being a couple nice ones. Again, I think I maybe, if I recall, these might have been 25 bucks. So again, I don't know what kind of values. I haven't looked up any values on these. I just thought they looked cool. It's like, I'm going to get them. Cunha Jr. Throw the bow in there. Here we go. A little recap. We got over here, McKenzie, Posh, Baseball, the 3D motion. So four of those. That's pretty cool. Some of the stars on that, Bichette, Acuna, oh, Tani. And then here comes, we had a parallel, Trevor Bauer, 70th anniversary, silver. A few rookie parallels, four of them to be exact. I mean, an Ice Ice Baby and a gold, but then two rainbow foils. And then the base rookies, Jazz, Cronenworth, Jazz, Cronenworth, and Kurloff. But I appreciate you guys tuning in. Please like, subscribe, share, comment below. Probably have some more openings either later tonight or tomorrow on Sunday. Hope you guys have a great day. Until next time, peace.